Cheryl school officials say two students remain hospitalized and they now face a long road to recovery. But the other players on that bus are now home and many feel grateful to be back at school. At an afternoon mass, prayer and high emotion, the St. Ignatius school community pouring out its heart. The school's been nothing but just a big family the past few days, showing just support for the whole program. Charlie Reef's younger brother escaped serious injury while on board this bus Saturday night with other members of the junior varsity hockey team. The bus hit by a semi truck in north central Indiana, injuring 16 players, three of them critically. It's definitely scary, and you know, there's a lot of stories about like bus accidents like that, and just kind of like surreal that it happened so close to our community. The semi truck driver, 58 year old Victor Santos, allegedly failed a field sobriety test and has now been charged with multiple felonies. At St. Ignatius, players and coaches grateful for an outpouring of support, which includes this tweet from the Blackhawks. Hockey's just a game, but um, you know, we are a close community to support uh, uh, the good times, but definitely the, the trying times like this. First of all, um, the hockey community is mighty, um, and we turn to love first. The St. Ignatius varsity team takes the ice again on Thursday for a game that will have new meaning. Every game for the rest of the year and the next year when I'm a senior, it's just think about um, I'm playing for them. As for the junior varsity team, their season is now on hold. School officials say they're going to be talking with parents about whether or not to return to the ice this season. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.